Hey everybody, welcome back to a little bit more of Feed the Beast Infinity. This is War. How are you doing? Give you some time to answer. Unusual. That is unusual. It's unusual that there are two this close. Look what we got here. This is not too far from where we've set up. I just want to take a quick look and then get out. It is... Uh oh. Uh, we might have to just get out right now. There aren't going to be beds here, are there? Oh, wait a minute. Maybe there's a witchery. Or not a witchery. Uh, what's it called? The apothecary? I'm stealing this. Um, shoot. These straw men are everywhere. Uh, is there a bed in the apothecary? I can't remember. I honestly don't know. That's... I think this is the one I'm looking for. There's no bed. We gotta go. Otherwise, they're all gonna get murdered. I'll come back and loot it in the daytime. Yeah. 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 Um, look at my mini-map. What the heck is Jaded Cat doing in my game? <laughs> what? I gotta, I gotta figure out what the heck that is. Uh, okay, that's disturbing is that I'm freaked out right now what the heck it's coming to kill me whatever it is and it's meowing oh man that I am freaked out you go away I will have none of the oh my god that is freaky uh where was that village let's just Get away from... Jesus, she's still coming. What in the hell? Uh, this way. Ah, and we are just littered with mobs along the way. Let's start by getting some distance from Jaded Cat. Holy cow, that is some creepy... Ah, oh, that is so creepy. Like, I want to see how much damage it'll do. Oh, man, this is just not your day, is it? Killed for a hat. Ah, that is so terrible for you. Oh, is she... Did she despawn? I think she despawned. Man, I'm like... I'm seriously... Oh, God. <laughs> I'm hearing footsteps all around me. I'm just... I'm freaking out. That is just not right. Uh, I'll take that. Um... I'll definitely take that. Ah, slimy stuff. I think it's the blue slime, though. It gives you better... You know... Crap. I should just take it all. I don't have the inventory for it, though. Um... I might come back when I have better stuff. Because at the moment... Oh, this is the one I want. At the moment, this doesn't really... Uh, help me... Help me much... Because I've got, like... Oh, there was a fun little spike. I've got, like, nothing. Um, let's check another Tinker's house. Oh, let's check in here first. Hey, now. Hey, hey, hey. I like those things. Dimlets. Okay. Flippers and a helmet. I'm going to leave these things here. Um, interesting. How much is a dimlet researcher cost. Now, you might have noticed from my search bar there uh, an unknown comparator, so I'd have to go to the nether. I'm a ways from that. I'm going to leave it. Oh, but you know what? There's some water that this will just... it'll make life easier. You're not going to get killed for a hat, even though I'm tempted. Uh, I'll come back for some of these things later when I'm richer. Um, what do we got here? Flint. Obsidian. I'll take the obsidian sword. You bet. The rest of these are kind of garbage. Now, what do I need for a sword? Is it a crossbar and a stick? That, I keep going to the wrong table. Uh, it's the guard. Handguard. I think this will add... <clears throat> Or not add, but give me a, a a little bit higher starting durability, I think. Law 
longsword. That looks a little different than this longsword, doesn't it? Oh, it's a longsword, not a... Okay. Attack, three hearts... Sprinting, I can do four and a half. Oh. Well, maybe I'm mistaken then about the, the guard um, adding. Um, adding more durability to it. It's still it's still slightly better. You see you got a, a plus six, so it's it's slightly better. Let's check out the Let's see, what else do we got? I think this is just a, a little one, or not one, tiny one room. I <laughs> did it again. Tiny little hut. Okay, you can stay. We all know I'm going to be back to, to cannibalize this place fully. Hey, buddy, you got visitors. You should st you should try cleaning your yard. Um, I kind of thought there would be a beehive there. I guess not. Let's check the railcraft building. Uh, I'll take this. Uh, the rest of this I don't have any use for at the moment. Nothing in the rolling machine. Or the engine. And I don't think these rooms have anything. Uh, what else do we got? Empty room. I've got a wheat farm here I can steal from. Man, look at all of the entities around the area. Just so many villagers, too. Can you? You can. Hey, first diamond. And I didn't even have to mine. Uh, I'll take the bread, you bet. Thank you. I appreciate that, apothecary guy. Oh, this guy just saw me steal. Wool for emeralds, huh? Well, I'm sorry, you saw me steal. No witnesses! Oh, no, he's not home. I, I don't know where he is. See ya. What else do we got? Uh, I checked that, I checked that. I think this is a, a bookcase house. It's not a bookcase house. I don't know my Minecraft houses anymore, it seems. <laughs> um, we checked this one. That was the first one we checked. I will take this whole thing, probably. Um, I want to have a place to put it, though, is the thing. I don't have a place to put it. I don't have a place to put any anything, really, just yet. There's never anything in these, right? Right. Okay. I guess there are no bookcases here for me to steal. Um, which is... F oh, it's right here. Uh, I was about to say that's fine, because I don't actually have a... means to enchant anything. Black ink. <laughs> oh, what a joke. What am I going to do with a black ink? Ugh. Mistcraft, you mystify me. Uh, we check that one. So there's not one of those straight up uh, library type houses. So that's whatever. I don't... Coven Witch, right? Friends? Yeah, we're friends. Coven Witch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Alright, let me head back to base. I came out because, um, as you might have seen, I had the Lexica Batania on my search bar because I had forgotten how to make it. So I came out to find cows and sugarcane. I should have grown more sugar before I did that. But I didn't. But I wanted to maybe get started in Batania a little earlier than I normally do. So I'm going to look at what my options are uh, here and, yeah, maybe do a little bit of that. So let me get back to base and I'll meet you there. Hey, <clears throat> by the way, I just thought I'd, I'd uh, thank everybody for for recommending I move into this neighborhood. It's not like it's already populated by a bunch of hoodlums. God, seriously now. Look at this. Oh, how fast do we go in here with flippers? Eh, kind of, kind of the same. This is the hole in the ground. How did I miss that, right? 
I tell you. Okay. I like the saturation. Okay. So, our plan... There should really be some light in here. I'm going to come in. I'm going to be ambushed. You know, I know I did this already. What the heck, man? <laughs> uh, one of these days we'll put a door or something here as well. Now, the first step for Batania, what we're going to want is a pure daisy, because that's how we're going to transform our wooden stone into living wood and living rock. Uh, and for that, we need four mystical white petals. Oh, right. And a petal apothecary. So I'm going to have to find some white flowers, and then the petal apothecary... Uh, I think it's just regular stone. Oh, no, it's cobblestone. And any kind of flower. Okay. I guess I'm not quite ready to be back with you just yet. Getting a little cramped in here. Might have to move out soon. Ah, uh, hmm. I can't even... Like, look at this. I can't even really expand the place. There's just, uh, there's nowhere to go. Yeah. Also running low on storage. That's no problem. <clears throat> I'll deal with it another time. So, what we're going to do is we got our white petals here. And I need, oh, I need a regular seed. Hey, hey, I got one. Terrific. Cool. Now, the problem is we're... <laughs> I've never tried to do Batania underground. I'm a little curious. Uh, obviously, you're not going to plant it on Stone War, you dummy. I just want to see if this actually works, now that I think about it. Uh, while that maybe happens... Um, <laughs> let's make another chest. This is ridiculous. I've been looking at some of the other mods in this pack. Actually, I was looking for um, thermal dynamics, which is what would... This is new for me. I don't remember that last time I played around with witchery. <clears throat> um, thermal dynamics is what adds the... Oh, I didn't even realize I picked that up. The ducks, the uh, item ducks, fluid ducks, whatever, the thermal expansion brand. Uh, whatever you want to call them. And so I was looking to see why I don't have that because it's listed in the list of mods for for Infinity, but it turns out... Mm, give me one more of those and let's turn those into torches. I believe that that's all like super beta still, so the way that it's set up is you have to like opt into that until that particular... Uh, mod is 100% ready to go. So with that in mind, I might not bother. Well, hey, that was really cool. I could use this for mining. <laughs> oh, that was neat. Um, I might not bother too much or or care too much, I should say. I'm not going to I'm not going to enable it is what I'm getting at. Um, because it just, to me, if it's still, like, so much in beta that they make you opt into it, then I'm just not going to deal with it. We're getting achievements, too. Cool. Uh, next up, I believe we're going to want our altar. Oh, you know what, actually? Oh, I do have a diamond I could use for this, but I need, I, I don't need an altar first. I need a mana pool. Uh, that is in here, but actually, I'm getting ahead of myself again. Because in order to put any mana in there, we're going to need a mana flower of some kind. And the easiest way, of course, is to go with a day bloom when that definitely needs to be outside. But we're going to need yellows, a blue, and an orange, a light blue. Make sure we get that right. So, yeah, I'm going to take care of this right now, actually. I'd like to be able to see what's waiting to kill me. 
<laughs> I've, I know, I got a mini-map. Uh, yeah, let's go hunt some flowers, I suppose. Let's go hunt some flowers some other time, when it's not dark. Here he comes. Here he comes. Charge! Man, I don't know. Maybe I'm just not doing it right. <laughs> Did you hear that? It's uh, right up above there. I've just been moving the, I've just been moving the pure daisy around, and um, man, I still hear things. Things coming to kill me, I'm sure. But yeah, I've just been moving it around, <clears throat> pushing it farther back, like by a block or two, um, <laughs> to kind of do some mining at the same time. Because I'd rather do that than waste. Is this more appetite? That is more appetite. Uh, then waste coal cooking stone, so it just makes sense to me to do it that way. We got ourselves a nice little cave system here. I, I actually kind of like this as a starting location. I'm surprised at how much area we got. And it goes down quite a ways, too. Uh, I've gone exploring just a little bit. Not too much, probably not as much as I should have by now, but no big deal going to need more water in there eventually. See, there we go. And then what I do is I just come around like this, clear it out, grab my living rock, punch a hole one farther back, pop in a piece of dirt, grab my daisy, and bam, put a little light on it. So yeah, that's about it. Um, <clears throat> yeah, whatever. I'm going to have to do some serious, like, wood farming already. I can feel that. I always forget. You always take these things for granted when you, uh, when you start out a new world. You're like, okay, I'm just going to do this and this and this, especially with modded Minecraft. Okay, yellow, light, blue, and orange. I think that's a light blue right there. And you, you take these things for granted. You're like, oh, man, I'm going to have so many overpowered machines, and that's cyan. And you're just gonna, everything's gonna be awesome, like right off the bat. And it's just not the case. A lot of it is this, <laughs> is looking for, that's a weird flower, flax. Interesting. Here's our orange. I've already forgotten what I need. Yellow and light blue now. What is that? Oh, it's a, it's a guy on fire. So... I gotta keep telling myself, oh man, do you see that on the map? There's another named guy. Underground, maybe? I think that's another mod developer's name. I think that's what's going on here. Is there somebody... <laughs> somebody is just, it's... God, man, they are really, they're good at screwing with me because it's freaking me the heck out when I see those names pop up. Uh... Yeah, I'm moving at normal speed. Okay, flippers are pretty rocking. I like it. What mod do they come from? Biomes of plenty. I have n oh, I have never used them before, and I'm kind of wishing I had now. Okay, so I've got my one orange, I've got my one light blue, and I've got my two yellows. Cool. Uh, we're gonna need regular seeds too. Oh, I should have raided that farm when I was at the at the the village. Cause now I'm gonna get all these seeds that I don't need. Oh man. <laughs> Just give me one seed, please. Oh, give me one seed and I will grow it and love it and walk it every day. Cool. Well, which way's the way back? Oh yeah. Big pile of <laughs> food. <laughs> That's my landmark, because I don't, I don't like playing with a bunch of waypoints enabled, so <laughs> I gotta have the landmark. Oh, here we go. Um, let's see here. I know I've found some bones from my rumbles with the skeletons so far. So, let's put it right here. I thought for a second I might end up, uh, Digging down through into, um, not you, you. <laughs> digging down through into, um, the cave below me. 
Oh, you know what else we're going to need? Yep, yep. Your mom. Ha, I'm just kidding. I, I'm sure she's a fine lady. Hey, cool. I forget which mod does that, but I like it. Let's just give it all to me. Thank you. Cool. Got a bunch of seeds. Got my wheat. Uh, go back in there. One of you and one of you can go back in there. All of you except for one can go back in there. And now we are ready to make our day bloom. Cool. Give me that food, please. Now, the problem is that now my Batania setup needs to move upstairs. And I don't know if I'm prepared for that. Because it's dangerous out there at night. And during the day, <laughs> there are crazed mod developers wandering my world. Trying to kill me. This, I th think I'm going to need a mana spreader, actually. See? This is Batania for you. <laughs> I love this mod, but I do not ever remember what I need. So let me turn some wood into living wood. This is what we're trying to make right here. Uh-oh. No version that doesn't require gold. Crap. All right, I'm going to go mining. I'll be back with you in a bit. So, <clears throat> I might have been wrong when I said this was a pretty good cave. All I'm seeing is iron, coal. I'm, I'm seeing, like, everything except for the precious metals that I actually want. Uh, let me over. I don't want these bushes just yet. Not until I have a way of using them properly. Something I was curious about though. I've picked up some of these Project Red Sapphires. I know they can be used to make tools. They got a decent durability on them. Uh, let's see. Can they... Yeah. Okay. It looks like they can mine the same thing. According to, to what am I looking at anyway. Yeah. They can mine the same thing iron can. So... That's nice. Um, I came around the corner just up here, and I spotted the sapphire, and I also spotted um, some peridot, which actually scared the crap out of me. I thought it was a creeper. Uh, and then I... Oh. Yeah, we weren't talking about you, by the way. Nosy. Yeah, this is what I had seen. Uh, farther up, though. <clears throat> Scared the crap out of me. Here's our gold. Oh, not with a sword, guy. Cool. So, this is going to be a lot better than I thought. Happened a lot faster than I thought, too. I I hadn't really looked around too much, and I think I was just being complainy pants right off the bat. Okay. Uh, dead end. That's fine. Give me a stack of torches, please. Not also not too concerned about lighting up the cave because when I build the spawner, obviously in modded Minecraft, it will rely absolutely zero on the caves being lit up. Oh, that's neat. The leaves on the ground like that. So, yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah, let's do this. Why not? Go ahead, bring your bat friends. Oh, that's how you sprint. Yeah, you sprint and dash. I knew there was a trick to this thing that I just wasn't getting. And now look at this. We're just up to our armpits in gold, it looks like. So, actually, let's look around this cave a little bit more before we head back, because, yes, I saw the ravine. I just don't want any surprises from this direction. We're quite a ways down. I might pick up more of the sapphire. Um, that's... <laughs> you gotta swing. <laughs> it just charges. It doesn't It doesn't do the sword swinging for you. A lot of essence bushes, too. I think that's neat. Uh, hey, another ravine. 
Which one do we go to first? Oh god, I can't decide. I heard that. I'm running this way because I didn't see that. I should have picked up um, one of them waters instead of just destroying it. That wasn't too smart, now was it? Let's go check this ravine. I bet there's water in it. Oh. Uh, well, there's death. I mean, that's for sure. What's a good way down? Oh, I know. There we go. Got it. Nailed it. Oh, wow. It's a beauty, too. All kinds of neat stuff. No more complaining about ores, war. You're... Jesus! What are you? Hiya! Oh, man, he hits hard. Let's not let that happen again. Fallen Knight. Oh, man. That guy scared me, too. We got... Lots of varied ores here. Thanks for... Oh, flippers! Oh, flippers! Oh, wow. Okay. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, this is this is a great find here. Uh, from what I can tell, anyway. Oh, come on! Flippers don't like to work against the current, it would seem. Oh! Almost in the lava. Okay, well... <clears throat> Let me meet you. Dang it. It's doing that thing where it has to load for a second. Uh, I'm going to take a little bit because I don't remember how to get back now. So I'll meet you back at the base. Okay. That wasn't so bad. Um, I actually cheated and just dug up. <laughs> I got lost. I was so lost. And it would have taken forever if I had tried to find my way out. And I don't have forever. Or something. So, yeah. So, there. <clears throat> Where were we? We were... Uh, let's put away... I got a lot of junk rocks accumulating now. Uh, stuff that I just don't need. I don't know, man. I do not know. I brought um, a crafting bench and a furnace with me. And, of course, I think you saw me leave my crafting bench behind. And I never fired up the furnace. Um, I think I had thought... I think I had thought that I was going to have to cook up some iron to... Uh, to replace my pick. I didn't realize that the sapphire pick was just as good. And I'll get started. I know, I'll, I'll get started on Tinker's Tools here shortly. I just... When I start out, I kind of don't care uh, how things go. There's always a hump. You know, I think you know what I mean. Uh, I don't really know which one I'm going to need, because I don't remember my Batania clearly, so we'll just use whatever. And here is our mana spreader. Give it to me, please, now. What's wrong? I put the pedal in the wrong place. <laughs> Alright, is it daytime? It was daytime, because I was just out there. Yeah, that's got to change. I can't keep doing that, that's going to drive me crazy. And then we aim that, bad boy. Well, that's not at all how I wanted to aim it. Uh, can we aim from here? We can. Now, the problem is that we need a, like a living wood wand. I planted these trees because they were all these little ground trees. So I planted them so I'd have some nicer trees to cut down. And it gives me a giant tree. Look, that's nice and all, but I'm looking for trees I can cut down. Okay, until I get a lumber axe, you're useless to me. So... Give me a second again. Uh, yum. I'm going to make uh, <clears throat> my wand of the forest. Is that what it's called? I don't have my lexica on me. Dang it. Uh, go back and back. And does it say where, in which one of these does it tell you? Wand of the forest, yeah. But which one tells you how to make it? <laughs> uh, oh, right here. Okay, I'm going to need... Oh. Two, four, six. Well, good thing that's exactly how much I got. Oh, 
Okay. Um, I'm trying to think here. What color? Because the colors that you make this out of are the colors that you get on your on your wand, and maybe I want to be picky. Maybe cyan? Nah, those are kind of boring looking. Blue? How blue are they? They're kind of blue. What about... Oh, quiet zombie. Blue and magenta. Gray, gray. How come you didn't stack? Oh, because one's light gray. Uh, black is black. Eh, screw it. We'll go blue and purple. Yeah. Yeah, that's alright. I'll take it. Okay. Oh. Well, whatever. You can stay. Now, if we come up here, we're on function mode. Uh, it doesn't really make a difference. Oh, but you can see we're already getting mana. Uh, we don't need to bind anything. I just wanted it to be able to see what the heck was going on, which, I mean, eventually we're definitely going to need, uh, we're definitely going to need to bind things, and it'll have a lot more use, but as for right now, it's more of a, hey, I want to be able to see, oh, there it is again. I wonder why that happens. And it's going to take a while before I have enough mana to make an actual mana pool, because you can't do anything with these diluted mana pools. They're just, they suck. They just suck. They're, yeah. Stepping stones. No problem, though. No problem. Batania is a fun mod, and that's why I've decided to go after it first. It's got a lot of neat, um, accessories. You see that red mark on my mini-map? It's underground, I guess. Yeah. It's got a lot of neat accessories that I want. Um, one of which being... Go back, please. Being uh, the Sojourner's stash. Stash. Sash. Uh, we just need iron for that, and we'll need... More iron, some wool, some feathers, that's no problem. But we're going to need our runic altar again, no problem. But you have to have a good mana pool. And then we're going to need this, which, yeah, I mean, we can totally do all these things. I just need to get to my altar. I'm going to end up using my one diamond for this, I just know. But I'll need to um, switch. There we go. Yeah, you got to have a regular mana pool. So, yeah. Stop being crummy. Anyway, I think that's going to do it for me for today. Uh, we got a good start going on Batania, at least. Well, <laughs> we might have a good start going at some point. Right now, obviously, uh, baby steps. I'm going to try and do some mining uh, off camera. Try and gather up some more resources, because being poor sucks. But, uh, yeah, I thank you very much for watching. Any feedback that you might have would be much appreciated. Or if you just wanted to hit that little thumbs up button, that wouldn't hurt my feelings one bit. And I will see you in the next episode. Next time on Wars Infinity. Hey, look at that. Give me back my son! I'm calling the police if you guys can't keep it down. Other people have to live here, you know. Oh, Jesus, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. Oh, Jesus.